Did you know that most people spend more time detailing their car when they are going to sell it than spending time fixing and cleaning their own house when it's time to put it on the market? Today we are going to talk about a few of the 101 quick and easy tips you need to take when selling your home to make it show like a model home. And make sure to watch till the end of this video for an offer on how to get your free room by room report of the 101 quick and easy tips to make your home show like a model home and sell it for the highest amount possible. Hi, I'm Julio Sanchez and I'm a local real estate broker here in the Inland Empire. And before we talk about these 101 tips that are super important when selling your own home, make sure to subscribe to this channel and tap that bell so you are notified of every single video that we upload. We upload videos every week about what it's like to live in this area, different areas of town, things to do in our area, market updates, home buyer and home selling tips, and much, much more. When you decide to place your home on the market for sale, it becomes a product. At least this is how the home buyers see it. Just like any product on the shelves at your local store, it has features and benefits, pluses and minuses, and there are many other products to compare to yours. To gain an advantage of your marketplace, not only your house must be priced right, but it has to look better than the competition. Sometimes it is difficult to think of your home as a mere product, but it helps to think that way so that you can get top dollar for your property and sell it in a reasonable amount of time. When you sell your home, you are going to have to move. When you move, you are going to have to pack. Most of the principles of staging just mean that you are going to pack up some of your things early. It is a little bit of work, but you are going to have to do it anyway. So let's do it now so that you can get top dollar for your property. In the first 15 seconds, your home will make a first impression. People make snap decisions in new situations. This is especially true during a showing of a home that they are considering. In preparing your home for the market, we need to put this straight of human nature to work for us. Your home needs to make an impression such as the snap judgment of a potential buyers are favorable. During the showing, the buyer will make judgments about the home as they view it through the lens form in those first 15 seconds. Remember, people judge what they cannot see by what they can see. There is so much of what a home has to offer that you cannot see. So we need to make sure that what they can see is presented perfectly. That's the purpose behind this video. There are four factors that control the sale of any home. Factor one is price. Two, it's terms. Number three is marketing. And number four is condition. Today we are talking about conditions, so we will concentrate on this topic only. Condition can be as important as price. If condition is not model home perfect, price will have to be adjusted. If you have ever been to a model home, you know how great they look. When homes have that kind of appeal, they sell quickly and usually for the highest price possible. Another interesting characteristic of good looking home is that usually the transaction is free of problems. It is more important to have price and condition perfected when your property first goes on the market. Implement the suggestions in this video as soon as possible because just like you cannot duplicate the first kiss, you cannot duplicate the debut of your property on the market. After the initial search of interest, the only people to look at it will be those buyers new to the marketplace. The initial impression we make with your property is critical. The first suggestion is to use a checklist. Take a note or mark items to repair and complete. Fix what needs fixing. If you have a honeydew list or know of items that need to be addressed at your home, do them up front. Do not let the buyer wonder if you have care for your home. Fix anything that needs addressed up front and avoid headaches later. With over 24 years of experience in the marketing and sale of homes will allow us to guide you in making low cost, high value enhancements to the positioning of your property. Any agent will tell you that one of the worst things that happens to them in the course of a showing property to qualified buyers is to drive up to a home and have them say, I don't want to look at this house. And this happens even before you have to put the car in park. This impression is nearly impossible to overcome. So here are a few tips for each room of the house. It all starts with creating curve appeal. The first impression people have of your house is what it looks like from the outside. What are they going to say to themselves as they approach your home? Believe it or not, some buyers make a decision to keep on driving just by looking at the outside of the house. Here are some tips to make them want to come inside. Tidy up the outside by removing 
the leaves, debris, branches, and other yard clutter to make a neat and tidy appearance. Give the hedges a fresh trim, paying special attention to anything blocking windows or getting in the way of walking to and from the house. Spruce up the lawn by cutting, trimming, weeding, and fertilizing where necessary. A great looking lawn makes a better impression than a neglected one. Wash the outside of the house if necessary, and consider painting if the house needs it or if the color is dated. Now, the entryway sets the stage. The buyer's first moments in the house are the moments of greatest anticipation about what's to come. It's here in the entryway that you set the stage for the experience throughout the rest of the house. Here are some tips to make the front entry experience a great one. Is the front door entrance or the front door make a good first impression? If not, consider a fresh coat of paint if necessary. Is the light on the front entrance working? If not, replace the light bulbs to brighten up the entry and make sure the light is on when people are coming. Clean out the front closet of all jackets, coats, boots, shoes, hats, gloves, and all the other clutter that gets thrown in the closet. Make the closet look spacious and uncluttered. Here are other tips for every other room in the house. Give the house a real once over cleaning. Clean it from top to bottom. Clean houses have a competitive advantage over dirty ones. Let some air in. Get a fresh breeze going to completely air out the house and get rid of any stale smells that you may not even notice. Start packing now. Pack up everything you don't use right now. Put it in boxes and store the boxes out of the house if possible. Think model home. Remove extra furniture and accessories. Make it appear spacious, not crowded. Clean and deodorize carpets. Paying special attention to high traffic areas and the stains that can be removed. Making the most of your kitchen and dining room. The kitchen is the heart of the home and it is the most highly valued home by buyers. So you want to make it show its best. Here are some tips to create a captivating kitchen. Cut down on visual clutter by removing items you normally store on the counter. This will help your kitchen look more spacious. Your eating kitchen should have a table and chairs in it. Buyers like to see an eating kitchen, but often they don't have the vision to see it as such without the furniture. It's a good idea to keep some cookie dough on hand and bake up a few cookies just before a showing, but don't overdo it. Make sure your counter is spotless and shiny. Can the buyers see themselves living in the living room? The living and family rooms are where your new buyers will do most of their living. So you want to make the space as inviting as possible. Here are some tips to make the living and family rooms appear their best. If you have a favorite old chair that doesn't go with the rest of the furniture, remove it. Big furniture can weigh down a space. Place a base with flowers on the coffee table or a tray with a teapot, cup set, and napkins. Clean your fireplace. Leave the lights on during the day for any day showings. Put away your holiday decorations unless you are showing your home during the holiday season. Open the drapes and blinds. Nothing is more depressing than walking into a home where shades, curtains, and drapes are closed. Plus, it makes the rooms look smaller. Make the bathrooms sparkle. Next to the kitchen, the bathroom is the room that gets the most examination. Some inexpensive tricks can make your bathroom look like a million dollars. Here are some tips, especially for the bathroom. Always empty bathroom trash cans before showings. Also, put the trash can under the vanity to clear floor space. You want the bathroom to appear as big as possible. A new shower curtain is a great investment. Very little money for a big impact. Things like toilet cleaners, plunges, and hampers are cluttered. Put them away while you're selling your house. Keep all reading material out of sight in the bathroom. Check the faucets for any leaks or drips. Repair or buy new faucets if they are leaky or worn out. Bedrooms are a key part of the home buying experience. Bigger is better. Nobody comments favorably about lovely tiny bedrooms. Just like other areas in the house, clutter takes up space and makes the room look smaller. Here are some tips to make your bedrooms look bigger and brighter. New bedspreads or quilts make a bedroom look inviting. Make your bed. Make it look pretty and make sure the bedspread or quilt fits the bed properly and hangs low enough to cover the view under the bed. Remove the Super Ninja Turtles posters or thrown out magazines covers in kids or teenage bedrooms. So a functional home office space can give your home a competitive advantage over other homes on the market. Here are some final tips. Keep the light of your house 
on at all times. Buyers will drive by your house at, at hours and you want your home to stand out. Please make sure all your valuables are put away. Do not leave anything of value laying around. This includes jewelry, cash, electronics, and any other items of value. Put away all your prescriptions as well, or at least away from the reach of children. Any firearms must be locked in a safe. These were some tips taken away from my 20 page room by room report. In this report, there are some tips on how to prepare your home for a photography appointment and tips for the actual showing of your home. And you can get this report absolutely free by calling or texting me at the number in the description below. Whether you're moving next month or within the next six months, I can send you more information about selling or buying a home here in Moreno Valley, Paris, Riverside, and any other areas. I have a free relocation guide that I can email to you free of charge and without obligation on your part. Well, that's it for today. My name is Julio Sanchez, and thank you so much for watching.